Yo guys, what is going on? Today we have a box from Box Lunch. So what I would look was looking for from Box Lunch was the Dr. Facilier Pop, the regular one, and the Chase one. So I did want to get uh, both. And as the great movie Scarface says, nothing exceeds like excess. So I ordered 10. So let's see if we get some chases in here. Here we go. Alright guys, so before we get into this, please smash that like button down below. Let me know you guys are enjoying these videos. And also, if you're not already subscribed to my videos, please hit the subscribe button down below and hit that bell notification so you guys are alerted as soon as I post new content. So like I said, this is the Dr. Vassellier Pops. I'm going to see if we can get a chase out of here. Um, I do collect Disney Pops as you guys can see, so I'm looking to complete the set. Hopefully, out of this 10, the majority are chases. I can add them to giveaways. Um, and also the regular ones, if you guys are interested, please let me know. I'll be happy to unload some of these because I'm sure there'll be some duplicates. Um, so without further ado, let's get right into that. Actually, before we get into that, I'm going to put a link up right there so you guys can check out uh, my 1,000 subscriber giveaway. It's pretty close to that, so if you guys are interested in getting a free pop, please check out that video for some more details. So let's open this box up. Hopefully... They did put them in the cardboard protectors that they do at Hot Topic and Box Lunch sometimes. So that I don't see them because I want to unbox these one by one. And hopefully there's at least one chase in there. If I were to 10 pops and there's not a single chase in there, I'm going to be pretty disappointed. But they did put them in cardboard boxes. There's also a $15 off $50 coupon in there. So this is for Torrid Insiders. I don't know what that is. It's not box lunch, so that's gonna get thrown away unless you guys know what tour it is. So, like I said, there's 10. I'm gonna do a one by one, and hopefully, the chase is in here. So, first, this is the first winner. Oh, oh man, this is starting off the right way. So, the first pull is a chase. Wow. So this is the Dr. Facilier Masked Chase. I haven't seen the glow on this to see what it is, but I'm pretty sure it's just the mask that glows. Um, if I get a good image of it, I'll put it here. If not, it's not going to be there. <laughs> but this Dr. Facilier Masked Chase is really, really nice. Um, I don't have many of the Disney chases. I know you guys have seen my chase video before, um, but all of them seem to be glow in the dark. I'm not sure why Disney does just glow in the dark ones instead of different variants. One of the more interesting pops that's come out this year and it's from a movie I do like. The Princess and Frog was a really good Disney movie and to get the chase on the first pull is a win. So oh, this is really good. I'm not going to strike out. You know ordering 10 pops and getting none I've seen people do before and you know that's not the way I'm trying to go out. So first pull is the chase so let's see if there's any more in there because I still want to complete the set. You know, 10 chases is fine, but to have the common version would be nice. So second box. This is the common. All right. So I can't win them all. But like I said, I'm looking to complete the set. There is the common Dr. Facilier Pop, Princess of the Frog. Not much different between the two. It's just the glow in the dark. And that seems to be the case with Disney Pops. I wish they would do something different. Um, I don't know if it's because Disney's trying to capitalize on, you know, different outfits and things like that as different pops, but they always seem, correct me if I'm wrong, but they seem to always do glow in the dark for their chases, which it is what it is, it's not preferred, because um, you can see the back here, they had adopted Facilier without the mask, this has the mask, and the comment should have just been the Dr. Facilier there. And the chase should just been him with the mask. If you want to make a glow, then go for it. But um, that you know, I digress. You know, I'm not too upset about getting the the, the you know different um, versions, the variants of the pop. But it'd be something different to see something you know new that they do with the Disney pops. So here's the third pop. Uh, another common. So like I said, if you guys are interested in it, there could be plenty of commons. I'm pretty sure uh, you know towards giveaways or towards um, just trades. So. I have my stash speeded down there. If you guys are interested in trades, I'd be more than happy to hook you guys up with this. Number four. Hoping for another chase, because that would be nice to add in the giveaway for you guys. Number four. Woo. Is that the chase? 
No. <laughs> so that's the comments. That's the bad part of these chases. I gotta look very hard to see if this is the different one or not. And that always comes down to that sticker. So three commons and one chase. So not bad. You know, the chase variants are what? One out of six. Um, so, so far, you know, not going against the odds. Um, you know, I, some people have said that they want the chases to go back to, or not back to, but to be one in 36, like how those um, DC metallic pops are. That'd be nice. Um, it would, you know, prevent some people from getting chases and they'd probably be more expensive. Um, but they'd also be more sought after and it'd be, you know, a little bit more interesting. For right now, this pop I think is going for like 50, 50, 50 55 dollars right now. Um, but if it was a one in 36, I think that'd be more than the $100 range. Because that has the potential to go down the more people that are unboxing the chase. But here's number five. Number five. Oh, yeah. All right. So that is the second chase. So, like I said, they're one out of six. So, to get two in a box of ten, I beat the odds. This was a successful unboxing already, and I'm only halfway through. So, again, there's another dot to facilitate chase right there. Here's the other. So, two for two, well, two for five. Not bad at all, guys. So, here you go. And, you know, this would be something I might add to the giveaway if you guys are interested. But, dot to facilitate pops. So for some reason, this actually has some box damage. I don't know how you get it right from the factory in a carbon protector, in a box, and there's still damage to it. But, you know, like I said, I don't really care about that stuff at all. But it's still kind of amazing how there's some damage on it. So, let's get to number six. Number six is a common. All right. So, four commons, two chases. Not bad. There you go. If you guys have not checked out Princess and the Frog, um, I do like that movie. It's not a one, it's one of the better ones that Disney has put out recently. I haven't checked out a lot of Disney's new movies. I'm old now, so I forget to watch all the kids' movies. But Princess and the Frog came out probably when I was in like, I don't know, high school. So I did check that one out. It's pretty good. So if you guys haven't checked it out, definitely suggest that one. Number seven, seven, seven. It is a common. All right, so hopefully it's not all commons the rest of the box. You know, one or two more chases would be nice, um, but that is now five commons and two chases. Let's get right to the next one. Not much more to say about that. All right, hopefully this is a chase. Rub this one for good luck. I don't think they have any markings on the outside to determine if it's a chase or not, so that's a good thing. That's why I don't like when Hot Topic and Box Lunch don't have them in these protectors, um, because then somebody at the factory well, they probably still could, but you can see if this is going to be a chase or not if you don't have this box. Um, but with this box, I just feel like it's a little bit more random. So here's number eight. Number eight is another chase. All right. There you go. Another chase. So I've had good luck with these chase boxes. Um, I, believe me, guys, these aren't fixed. I don't try to fix the videos in any way. This is all real, but look at that damn <laughs> that is a lot of box damage for being in a protector in a box in a box wow so <laughs> i won't give this one away unless you guys are interested you know a lot of people don't uh, like the box damage ones i'll keep this one this that's fine with me but there you go the, the dr facility chase this is number three so we have two more and maybe we get two more chases and go half commons and half chases. That would be amazing. So let's see if that happens. Number nine. Number nine. It's not happening. <laughs> All right, so that is another common. Six and three. I, I actually haven't seen this Lewis. I do want that one too. The Tiana and Naveen, I can pass on. Although the Naveen's pretty cool. I don't really like the princess pops. And Aladdin's my favorite movie, but even Jasmine, it just doesn't cut it for me. I'm grown man, I don't need many princesses. <laughs> but um, number 10, he's the last hope. Uh, we're either gonna go, what's that, seven and three or six and four? Let's see. Number 10. 
Oh man. All right, so it is another common. Seven and three, that is not a bad record. Or I guess that's three and seven, that's losing record. <laughs> but for me, that's not a loss. Uh, to get three when the odds were against your favor, it's a win. Three chases, six commons. Here is the set together. Again, pretty cool. The only difference is between the two pops is the glow. I'm actually gonna take this one out so you guys can get a better picture of the glow or see the, the pop in general. So let's open this one up. Here you go. So this is the Dr. Facilier pop. You got that skull on the top, the mask from when he's, uh, I think the scene from the movies when he's singing the song, I got friends on the other side. Definitely a really cool voodoo, New Orleans vibe. I don't like New Orleans, I'm a Falcons fan as you can see. I don't plan on ever going to New Orleans. Shout out to the Saints, glad you guys lost. <laughs> but uh, yeah, this is a decent looking pop. I mean, I've had my eyes on you know th this one since it dropped. I've been waiting to get in the mail and finally did. So glad I finally got this one and glad I got some chases to add to the collection. So all in all, that's I think I did well. Um, please let me know guys how you feel about uh, the Dr. Facilier Pop. If you guys did grab a chase as well. Um, I don't have a box lunch in my area. Um, I don't know where one even exists. So I have to order them online. I'm glad I actually got some from online, which is nice. Um, so as always, like, comment, share, and subscribe these, to my videos. Thank you so much for my, your support, guys. And like I said, please check out that 1,000 subscriber giveaway video as well so you guys can win a pop. Thank you so much, guys. Until next time, see you later.